Ich bin ein bisschen schlechter. 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 Ich bin ein bisschen Metro Station there. So, uh, the reason I wasn't here yesterday was because I took the day off. There's a lot of speculation flying around with the uh, diehard fans of the show kind of going, Oh, where, where was he? What was he doing? That will be the first day off in about six years. I know, first uh, kind of a holiday day off. And um, it's a real simple reason. I went away for the weekend, which I've not really done before, and I went away to New York. For the weekend, Ooh. which sounds very, very flashy, and there was uh, certain reasons for this. Number one, uh, I had some air miles to cash in. Someone suggested that online. It's pretty. It's pretty much. Yeah. What was it? What, so was it was? free then? Uh, to all intents and purposes, right. yeah, I suppose so. And um, and I had a companion voucher which I had to cash in, otherwise I was going to run out. What's that? Um, it basically means you kind of cash in your air miles. You buy a ticket, yeah. and you get another ticket. Free, wow! And uh, and if I was I was going to waste it unless I went away, so I went away. Went Very to good. New York for the weekend, which I've never done before, and um, it's great. It was bizarre. Friday morning did the show. Friday evening, I'm stood in Times Square in New York, and it was How just strange. really bizarre. It was really bizarre. You continued to tweet. Not many. But it was weird, because I knew you were there, but then I saw a few messages come up, and I was thinking, that's strange. Where are you now? Mm. Anyone spot was... you? Yeah, a few people. Wow. Yeah, it wasn't too bad. And um, had a very showbiz flight on the way out. Any guess who's? No, because um, I'll tell you who they were. Because I don't think... We'll be going around the world if we're you know, trying to find out the answer. So one of them was Bill Nye, the actor. Right. right. Who I met very briefly as we're getting on the plane. And the other one... Um, asking mum and dad was Neil Sadaka. Oh, really? <laughs> Who uh, I've never heard of him. He he's kind of like a New York version of Tony Christie, which I think is a good way to describe him. He's a famous pianist, isn't he? Do you know what's really strange? Who? Neil Stacker. Um, I don't know if he plays the piano. No, he sang. He was sang. He not yeah. a pianist. Yeah. Neil Sadaka sure sang he like plays he might, piano. He might play the piano as well. Hang he, on. Like did breaking up his heart. He did loads of loads of songs in the sixties. Kind I of like he did everything on the piano. This is really strange. I was with some people from BBC Wales who've just done a Legends program about him. Well, there you How go. How weird. He is a legend. He said like he sold millions and millions and millions of records. And apparently he writes a lot too. Yeah, he I does. I was kind of saying, well, who is he? He's and they kind of loads. were telling me. Yeah. yeah. He's kind of like a Gary Barlow, but, you know, for uh, three generations before. Maybe not three, but, uh, you know. Certainly two. So, uh, we flew off Friday afternoon, and then um, uh, Friday night, got to the, in New York, got to the hotel, and kind of went wandering around Times Square, and then just were so ridiculously tired. Because I've been up since, like, quarter past five Friday morning, and then I'm in New York at eight o'clock at night, but... It's actually one o'clock in the morning mm. by the time, and so it's like the longest day ever, isn't it? When you do that, so uh, so we just we just sat in the room and watched a movie, and then got up early, and then Saturday morning I got up and went for a run around Central Park. Which oh, was very cool! Exciting. I've done that. Did you go to the reservoir in the middle? Yeah. Oh, Did cool. you run around there? Yeah, run around there. Oh, that's a long way. It's six miles the whole park. Is it? Is it? Yeah, it's huge. I didn't do the whole park. I basically ran down Broadway. Yeah. From Times Square down Broadway uh, into the park. All the way down, past the Ghostbusters building, and then uh, round this big reservoir, the Jackie Onassis re Reservoir, whatever it's called, and then back again. So that was enough. What? Sorry, Matt, there's a message Matt keeps standing me. in front of uh, the cameras. Because he's an idiot. Um, and then uh, when did a bit of shopping? A bit of shopping. A lot of shopping. I tell you what, I did eat. I, I, I kind of I didn't eat very well when I was in New York because I'm in New York so I had a few burgers and whatnot and a couple of milkshakes and didn't eat massively well however I went for a run Saturday morning I went for a run Sunday morning I must have walked a gazillion miles over the whole weekend because it's just it was such a nice day mm. Saturday it was really hot 
Sunday was even hotter. So you just walk. You go, how far away? That's oh, only a few blocks away. We'll just walk. You just walk everywhere yeah. in New York. It's just, we walked miles. Miles and miles. Are you a week off weighing Tuesday or is it today? Is it it's next, next Tuesday. Oh, no. oh, that's good. Yeah, I know. You'll tell do me, good. Tell me about it. So I'm going to be a really good boy between now and then, with the only exception being Saturday, which is your missus' birthday. Oh, yeah. I was thinking, what's Saturday? Oh, yeah, you're right. I've heard a rumour about Dave's party, by the way. Go ask me about it. A rumour? Yeah, I've heard a rumour about what? your party. What sort of rumour? I've heard, I've heard that, you've hi- that so many people are coming to your party that you're hiring... Toilets. Hiring one toilet. You are hiring a toilet. You're hiring a portaloo. Uh, yeah. That's brilliant. <laughs> you have changed. Why? Hasn't it? You're hiring a portaloo. Have you got waiters that? and stuff? But no. But you've got a downstairs loo as well. He doesn't yeah. want us in the house. No. What'll happen is that ladies uh, there's can a, there's use a the downstairs there, loo, darling. and then all the men can use the outside loo. Where's that going to go? In the garden. Whereabouts? I don't know. Kind of down the end, away from all the food. Yeah. Right. Well, not next, to, not next to the buffet. No, that would be wrong, wouldn't it? Dave has hired a portal. Well, no, I haven't. I'm actually looking into it at the moment. Oh, really? Speak. But then, yeah. Dave, your garden is so big. I'd feel yeah, quite comfortable I... going down to the West Wing and just having a pee in the bushes. But I don't want. <laughs> I don't want people. Na- I mean, people will obviously as the day goes on, but I don't want the general rule for them to everyone pee in the bushes. What do you mean they will? Just tell them no. Well, that's what I wouldn't, I wouldn't pee in the bush at your garden. Portalies aren't expensive could, to hire for it, the day. I don't know. I've never hired them. They're like <laughs> 20 quid or something. Are really? they? 30 yep. quid. Yeah, they're not much. I reckon they're more than that. I don't think so. At 200. Glastonbury, oh, I can't remember what the sign is. There's some great signs about basically go and use the toilets. You should go and see what you can borrow them off Michael Evis. Okay. I mean, I'm not, not hiring one of his 200 quid, but if it's like 20, 30 quid, we'll hire one. it will be like a big porta cabin with that blue stuff in and, you know... It, no, it'll just be like one... You know and... you know when you see people who've got builders in and stuff and then they have a porta on their drive? Be right. one of them. Nice. Hidden behind a tree somewhere. Glamorous. You yeah. could get one of the toilets that, like the ones we had at Kilimanjaro. Where are people a bucket. Gonna, where are people going <laughs> to park, by the way? You're going to bring your village to a standstill. No, well, I've, I've got that all sorted. Oh, you have got that sorted yeah. as well. But I'm not going to say where and what sure. exactly, because otherwise they'll give away in the entire have location. Have you sold the photos to any magazines? No. Or? This, honestly, this, is, this party's going to be slightly smaller than Glastonbury. It's getting there. But no, we have parking sorted. We have <laughs> toilet situation <laughs> sorted. Field. Have you alerted the local cab firms? Uh, no, not yet. Right. But they will be alerted. <laughs> it's all fine. It's all in hand. It's so like anyway... Dave Stock... So, yeah, so I'm going to have to be a good boy this week. I'm going to have to train really hard, watch why you eat, and then just have a day off on Saturday for the mm. uh, for the party before next Tuesday's weigh-in. But New York was great. It was really nice. I recommend it. Good. You know what? And there's times of credit crunch and whatnot. If, you, if you've saved any money on your mortgage, as Peter Jones was saying when he came on the show, get it spent. It's your money. Or now's the time to cash in on your points. Mm. If you build points, because you, you can, you know. If you use that as a credit card and stuff, just cash them in now. Well, that's what I did. That's pretty much what I did. And then uh, we just kind of went around. We just went shopping. We just bought a few bits and mo- just shopping is mainly going into shops while Sophie tries on a few things and then decides that they're not right. You see, she does that a lot. You say this. You talk about this all the time. I don't know. You should just leave Sophie to it. Yeah. And I do for a lot of the time. But there's only so much of standing outside shops I can bear. Mm. I may as well go and follow her around when I wanted to hurry up. I just follow her around. Couldn't you go off and do something? <laughs> I did a really annoying That's thing. <laughs> I just literally follow her. I'm going to go in this girl's shop here. Why don't you go in the boy's shop next door? No, I'm all right. I'll, I'll come in with you. Wherever she goes, I'm right behind her. Because you're putting pressure on her then. Absolutely. Oh, do you want to go? Yeah, yeah, she'll go and get some food. Well, I just wanted to have a, try these on. Oh, okay. I'll go with you. Oh, fine. We won't bother. And then, uh, and then that was it. Came back. But it was nice. It was a really nice little trip. And the weather was great. Was it? Was it? Mm, really hot yesterday. It's been very changeable here.